Hi, you guys. This is Prophetess Afia Sabrina Acapo, and I am back again via the leading of the Holy Spirit with a another prophetic word for you guys. As with any prophetic word, you would absolutely want to go to the Lord in prayer, testing the Spirit to affirm and confirm that perhaps this prophetic word is for you. Holy Spirit. I invite you in to take full charge, to take full control, to take full access. I decrease as you increase. Allow me to bring forth your word with your glory, with your power, with your grace, with your mercy, telling your story so your name can be glorified for the winning of souls to the gospel of Jesus Christ. In Jesus Christ, mighty name, then I do pray. Amen, 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 and amen. Tell you guys of this prophetic word is you're about to hit the target bullseye. <laughs> you're about to hit the target bullseye. Let me jump off into this word, you guys. Definitely jump into the key words of this story because I'm telling you, it's hitting some definitely middle points that are gonna cause you to win. And it's going to cause you to win big in every aspect and area of your life. So let me jump off into it. You are about to hit the target bull's eye. So you guys, I'm actually watching a movie last night. And they were actually playing with a bow and arrow. And the Lord began speaking and auctioning in my spirit that you are about to hit the target and the bull's eye. That it will be right in the middle and you will not miss the first time you're gonna hit in the middle and you will not miss the lord has said this is as well pertain to every single aspect and area of your life you're gonna hit the target in every aspect and area of your life and you will not miss then the lord showed me a baseball glove and said you are about to catch in a catcher's mitt so when they throw that ball you're gonna catch it then he brought the net back, saying, catch your net because this time will be a big catch. Do it again. Then on the board, I saw your high score that was lighting up because you had won the game. I hear game changer. Then the Lord showed me that you had hit a home run in every aspect and area of your life that you've That you've got this in the bag. Then the Lord gave me the word endurance. 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 Then he gave me David who they had actually underestimated. But what they did not know was David. David was fighting tigers and bears. So he had the faith along with the strength. He knew that he would defeat. He knew that he would defeat every Goliath and every giant. And he succeeded. And he won. And the Lord is saying, that had been for you. That had been your portion. You are winning this race in life because you are on the winning side. You are winning this race in life because you are on the winning side. And you hit the target because you refuse to give up. You refuse, and you hit the target because you refuse to give up and to finish what you have started. I'm going to say that again. You hit the target because you refuse to give up and you will finish what you started. Hebrews 12 and 1, therefore, since we are surrounded by such a great cloud of witnesses who by faith have testified to the truth of God's absolute faithfulness, stripping off every unnecessary weight and the sin which so easily and cleverly entangles us, let us run with endurance and active persistence. The race that is set before us. That not only are you running, but you are multiplying because you have just hit the target of additions in your life. Plurals in your life. The Lord showed me the two fish and five loaves of bread, giving a synopsis of how multitudes were fed. The Lord has said, apply these principles and practicalities to every area of your life. Luke 5 and 16. Taking the five loaves and the two fish and looking up to heaven, he gave thanks and broke them then he gave them to the disciples to distribute amongst the people the lord has said that had been the same for you he's giving you multiplicity to distribute amongst his people because he know that he can trust you he know that you're 
you have that faith and you have the, that tenacity knowing that you're going to win. And when you hit that target, it's dead in the middle. It's dead in the middle. It's spot on. The Lord is saying you are going to hit the target and win the ultimate prize. Then he took me back to David because you're winning the prize of position. You as well winning the prize of promotion because David went from a shepherd boy to a king. And I just heard bull's eye. You at the end will win the prize. First Corinthians 9 and 24. Do you not know that in a race? Oh, the runners run. They're very best to win, but only one receives the prize. Run your way, race in such a way that you may cease the prize and make it yours. The Lord is saying you're about to cease the opportunity. You're about to win. You're about to hit the target. It has already started. That you have hit the target and you are ruling and reigning because the enemy... That you have hit the target, you are ruling and reigning, and everything in your life is about to change. Thank you so much, Holy Spirit. I call you in to place the oil of the anointed in my mouth and on my lips. Place the oil of the anointed on my head and speak through me where I can bring this word forth with your power in this hour, in this new month, in the new season, because it's about ruling and reigning. It's about our life changing. Thus said the spirit of the living God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You have pinned the tail on the donkey and entered the era of your new life in the new month. And the Lord is saying, bulls eye, your new level has started. That part. The Lord is saying, good hit and this is it. And he gave David a completely new life. What more you? Throw your dart because this is your beginning of a fresh start. 2 Corinthians 5 and 17. Therefore, if anyone... Is in Christ that is grafted in, joined to him by faith in him as Savior. He is a new creature reborn and renewed by the Holy Spirit. The old things, the previous moral and spiritual condition have passed away. Behold, new things have come because spiritual awakening brings a new life. You're about to hit the target. The Lord is saying, Bulls, I. And I hear. You are about to get the rewards and the prize. I hear the Lord is saying you are about to get first place. You are the one that won the race of position. You are the one that won a race in a promotion in every aspect and area of your life. The Lord is saying you're receiving just like David became king. You are receiving queen and, and king that crown. You are about to hit the target bull's eye. Thus said the spirit of the living God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I love you guys. I am always praying for you guys. May the Lord richly bless each and every one of you guys and see you guys all through to the greatness of success of God's best knowing that we're just getting started. But when we hit, we're going to hit that middle dot. So we're going to hit that target our new month our new beginning it has just started it has just started you're about to hit the target bulls ah. thus said the spirit of the living god in the mighty name of jesus christ take care i love you guys once again and we will most certainly talk on the next god bless you bye-bye